Do that stuff? Do I got the stuff? You got the money? Do I got the money? <laughs> collect <laughs> I was freaking golden material you open up your special with that anyway let me start this off by saying I know a lot of y'all right now are new subscribers to this channel and I know y'all came from the four horsemen track this is what I gotta say off tops first of all Welcome to the SJ Nation family. Pull up. Pull up a chair. Grab some popcorn. You, you know what I mean? You, you need one of these? You need, you need this? You need something? You need one? You know how sometimes you got it, but you ain't got the roller ball. I got you. What you need? What you want? What we doing? Just let me know. Huh? I'm here for you. I do a lot of breakdowns, a lot of reactions. Shout out to Dak. Shout out to Crip. Shout out to Quideca. That song is killing. Bro, listen. We breaking YouTube with this one. If you ask me, this is all the illest rappers who are on the YouTube platform. I don't like using the YouTube rapper uh, moniker um, because I'm definitely not a YouTube rapper. I definitely was a rapper before I was doing YouTube. But I know if a lot of y'all got to know me through YouTube, I, I know, I know what it is. But just Google Screwfejean, S-C-R-U-F-A-C-E-J-E-A-N and you'll see I ain't playing. I'm on like famous people, birthdays, whatever. I know I'm the smallest dude on that track, but I appreciate Dax, Crip, and Quideca, you know what I mean, for the opportunity. Really Crip, because it was Crip's song, but shout out to Crip for putting this together. I feel like I've said Crip a lot. Crip, 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 Crip. Crip! <laughs> um, so, yeah, I upload every day. Um, I'm a goofy guy, kinda, yeah. I could be, oh, I got, I got range of emotions. I could be goofy. I could punch you in the mouth. It's whatever. It's whatever. I will be doing a live reaction. My whole live today, I go live, um, Monday, I go live every other day, Mondays, starting Wednesdays, Fridays, and then I go live on IG on Saturday. So, Today we're dedicating the whole episode to breaking down the Four Horsemen track. And if you knew, you know, I do my lives on the Screwface Live channel. It's not on this channel. It's on the Screwface Live channel. I'm going to be doing that for at least the next two months. Um, crazy, that first month flew by, though. I ain't going to play. But, uh, yeah. So, Boogie's album about to drop in like two days, huh? And it looked like Boogie doing everything that I said, you know what I mean? should happen oh yeah by the way if you don't know i do reactions too i do a lot of eminem reactions a lot and the reason why i do a lot of eminem reactions because i love lyrics i'm a lyricist i love people who maintain that and i think m is one of the highest 
lyricist. Does that, does that make sense? At the highest level, a lyricist of one of the highest levels in hip hop. So whatever this is the lyricist we do. But anyway, Boogie about to drop his album. So we went through the track list together as a family. I was like, yo, that track list kind of fire. And then I saw, then we, you know I mean, we sat back for a second for a real quick little secky sack. We sat down for a little secky sack and then they dropped the snippet, man. They dropped the snippet, man. They dropped the snippet. Cause I saw J.I.D. was on that project. I saw M was on that project. I saw Atunde Aduja was on that project. I saw Christian Scott is on that project. Who else is on it? Black, Six Lack. And I was so happy when I realized that the single that they're doing together was not going to be freak. Ah, yes. That is a slow clap. So, Rainy Days is the song. We have the snippet. Ladies and gentlemen of the s &J Nation, are you ready? <laughs> For some brand new M. <laughs> For some brand new buggy. <laughs> it ain't every day we get some brand new M and some brand new bug. This is Bug's first album. His official debut, John. So we gonna give my man all the respect he deserved. Before we start, I need everybody to hit that mother freaking like button. Get this to like 500 likes unless you, oh, you ain't a real new. <laughs> and I know it's gonna be, but I'm not a new. You just ain't real then. Shout out to West Side Boog, man. Let's get right to it. R a boogie featuring Eminem, Rainy Day Snippet. Ready, set, go. Oh, hold on. I didn't know it was going to be that bootleg quality. Hold on. <laughs> I didn't realize we were going to have that. I went to the movies and snuck, snuck my flip phone in my jacket and recorded the song quality. God damn. I didn't know we was going to have that. My bad. I know it was going to have that 2007 Napster uh, 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 I did not have sexual relations with that woman. Quality, y'all know what I'm talking about. If y'all had Napster. <laughs> yeah. Or what was it? Or LimeWire. LimeWire, that's what I had. I didn't have Napster. Napster was beyond before my time, kind of. That was 90 stuff. Oh, my bad. Let's go. Ready, set, go. Mm. Okay. Hold on. Now this is the snippet that's going around and hold on this. I think I think there's more on this. Um this this begs a lot of different questions. A lot of different questions shoot out from this. A lot of different questions shoot out. I'm gonna keep letting it rock. First of all, like I said, a Boogie t is a better hook writer, hook maker than M. M is not the greatest chorus maker right he's got some classic courses he's got some great courses but even i did a reaction to um an interview he did before uh the slim shady lp came out 99 and he was talking about how when he made the real slim shady he made the chorus on the spot and dr dre looked at him like yo family that might not be it playboy but then it's like it kind of takes a while for it to hit and feel the way it's supposed to feel i get it but I, like I said, like, M is not the greatest hook maker, so Boogie being on the hook, exactly what I want to hear, right? And this beat, M, I think it's going to force M to have a slow flow and really sit down and be methodical and, and melodical with it. And I'm really loving the... Yeah, I love that. I love that. I really do. I like that. It's like I haven't heard M on a type song like this. Just some some wavy butter sauce. Ready, set, go. I could already tell the beat is fire. Hold on, there's still more. Is there more? This mother effer right here. Must... Now I know dang well, though, that you ain't just 
<clears throat> excuse me, take a 12 second loop, 12 second little snippet and loop it for a minute. I know you ain't do that. You had me over here like, okay, yeah, all right, I heard that part. Okay, yeah, I heard that again. Okay, it, it must be a repeating hook. No, nah, it's a repeating hook. Don't, it's, it's gonna, he gonna have bars in it. It's, it's 59, it's 58 seconds. Can't just be that, that shit was like 12, right? And then you get halfway through the 30, you're like, he, he repeat one more time, you're like, wait a minute. And then it just end and you got, you got 20 to 25 seconds of, of dead space? Why you do that? Why you do that? Why you do that? Well, here's my thoughts on that little snippy snip, little second y'all know. I'm excited, bruh. Listen, I'm just so happy that the song they're doing together isn't Freak. Oh, God. And that song sound like that. That's like exactly kind of like the kind of Boogie and M I want to hear, man. That shit sound raw. I ain't in the, in the, in the, today. And it's like, I haven't really seen M on a real slow beat like that. Now, 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 put in the comment section if you think, if I'm wrong, what slow beat has Eminem jumped on? Like slow songs, and I know I'm wrong. Sing for the moment. It's like my favorite Eminem verse. That's a slow one. Matter of fact, scratch what I said. That was a stupid thing to say. He has a lot of songs like that because you cleaning out my closet. He has a lot of them. But don't you notice how I feel like when M be getting new M, not like young 90s M, early 2000s M, I mean new M. When new M is on a slow beat, I think that's when he really could cut, when he, when he really be saying some real prolific, prolific, man, word, word. Are you as excited for this as I am? Boogie's album drops tomorrow. No, not tomorrow. What's today? The 23rd. It drops on the 25th. You already know I'm going to have a live stream about that on that day. What we talking about, huh? We talking dumb. We got a new M. We got a new Boogie. We got a new Jid. I'm real excited to see what M's going to do on this beat. I'm mad excited, bro. I'm mad excited about what M's going to do on this beat. Facts. Big facts. Big soldier. <laughs> Put in the comment section if you think it's going to be fire. How you think I'm going to come on it? Um, make sure y'all go watch that uh, Four Horsemen on Crips channel. Uh, like, comment. Uh, uh, and make sure you, 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 you let them know that the SJ Nation is thicky. Like, I, as you know, I'm the smallest person. I've said that before. But I'm the smallest person on that song. So I want them to show that. Because like I said, we 46,000, but we, we, we sound like 4 mil. We move like 4 mil, man. SJ Nation, gang, gang, go gang up them comments. Go, 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 go jump those comments. Come together as a family and jump those co that comment section. Like, nigga, SJ, and they drop a whole bunch of SJ Nations. But don't put the hashtag in it because I think if you put the hashtag SJ Nation, it marks it a spam. Just put SJ Nation. <laughs> and, um, Dream Chases with me and Dax drops. The video drops next week. Love y'all. We out.